Hello guys, welcome back. So today we'll be creating a kind of wig minute, honestly, and let's see what we can come up with. So elements and search for par party. So we're gonna make this image the background. We're going to elements and put a green image over it first we're going to reduce this transparency put the green over it and reduce this transparency all right so we're going to go to shapes and we're going to change this color to white Okay, what I'm actually going to do is lock this so it cannot move. So I'm going to go for fruits and we want cutouts only. So we will just search for different elements and put them at the lining on the top of our circular element. We search for pineapple, we're searching for leaves. I'm gonna be choosing the best leaf design that complements the design that we're trying to do right now. If you have any questions, guys, leave it in the comment section. The design we're doing is for a summer brunch party and we want to utilize the colors yellow, green, white, so we're looking for cocktails we want it to look earthy and as we go along we're just going to update and change the elements so that we the elements that we actually choose actually go together and makes the design look appealing so we're going to play around at different element trees pineapples cocktails palm trees flowers and just decorate the top half of this circular element then we're going to bring the element to the front so that all these elements are actually behind the circular element. Then we're going to take care of the font. So we're going to search for gold letters. Going to select this one. And we're going to look for more like this so that we can find all the letters that we need to spell summer. We can actually group these elements and then resize them, but I'm resizing them individually. And then I'm going to space them how I want them on the screen. And now we're going to add text to the screen. So we're going to type in brunch. And the font that we're going to use is Allura. So then as usual, we're going to resize and position the text on the screen. We want to kind of have a little overlay to the word summer. So we're going to position it how we want it to appear. Another cool Canva trick is that we can actually highlight half of the word and change it into a different color and let the other half be a different color as well. So it's kind of like a gradient font. So that's how it's looking so far. Half of the font is yellow, the other half is green. And we're going to go in effects and we're going to choose lift. So that it has a little shadow behind the actual word. We're almost done, but we've got, we're going to do some tweaking of the actual design by changing the background color and using a transparent gradient that is found in the element section so that we have a nice hue effect over the design. Inserted the transparent gradient, we changed the direction that it was facing and now we're going to play around with the colors to see what gives the design the best effect.
we're still tweaking the design so we're going to change the background image to a brunch photo instead of an actual party then we're going to search for leaves again and we're going to line the bottom half of the circular element and then we're going to position it so that we can insert the text so in an effort to make the design more cohesive we're going to use the same leaf element at the top of our design as well We're just trying to make sure that the leaves actually line up properly at the back or the top of our design and moving around the elements so that they look visually appealing. Here is how you can actually group elements together. You press down on one element, press select multiple, select all the elements that you want to group. Then you press group at the top right side of the page and you can actually move the elements around to your liking. We're going to select text and use a template that's already there to insert the last text that we're going to do for this flyer design. So we're just going to insert it or click on it and just edit it with our information. From here, we're just going to reposition and change the color of the fonts so that it's easy, it's easily read under the flyer design. We're going to add a line right under the date and change the color to yellow. Change the color of the transparent gradient to white and change the color of the font to green. So our design is coming together very nicely. We're going to change the brunch font to green because I think the different colors is not too easy on the eyes. And that wraps up our design. Let's look at the finished product. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Thanks for watching. Until next time.